Welcome to the recreational fisheries video and we will be talking about what a recreational fishery is. And this video essentially is just to define what a recreational fish fishery is. So what is um, it? It's fishing for pleasure or competition rather than food, profit, or scientific research. So we have research, if you're doing research, that's a, that's a separate category. Profit is, for, is called commercial fishing, and food is called uh, subsistence fishing, if you're only fishing for food. Now, you can have um, a, the benefit of uh, bringing home some food from recreational fishing, but the primary goal is pleasure or competition. Uh, and it goes back a long, long time. Dame Juliana Berners, uh, 1496, she wrote the first uh, text on commercial, or sorry, recreational fishing. And um, she was deathly afraid that it would get into the hands of um, non-upper uh, uh, upper crust people and that the great unwashed would, um, would come in and sully the art of recreational fishing. Uh, so it, recreational fishing can take place on giant boats like this, uh, the Ultimate Lady, which goes out hundreds of miles off the off the shore and goes marlin fishing and things like that. Um, and you can have full electronics packages, no different, not really much different than a commercial vessel, or sometimes even better than a commercial vessel. Or you can be a got a guy on your own standing in a in a lake casting for trout, or even um, on a little kayak, or st standing on rocks with nothing but a fishing rod, or even something as simple as a stick with a little line on it. And so that's what the uh, point is. Recreational fishing is about um, pleasure, camaraderie, fishing with your family, spending time together, and hopefully getting a little bit of food out of it as well. But then again, you have people in the UK, trout or carp fishing is a very popular sport where people will go for two or three days, ground bait up an area and try to catch these uh, huge carp and they may have to wait one or two or three days even for a bite. So is recreational fishing economically important? Does it contribute to the economy and is it something that should be considered by fisheries managers? Well, uh, in the U.S. alone, this is uh, actually fairly old data, tw 2004, um, 12, but 12 million recreational saltwater fishers, uh, it's probably higher now, generate $30 billion in economic impact and support 350,000 jobs. So these are directly related to recreational fishers. And 11.5%, so 1 in 10 people regularly goes recreational fishing and they catch 11 million tons of fish. That is a massive amount of fish. Um, and that is really hard to estimate exactly what the recreational catch would be. So um, that, that, that number could be quite a bit higher. Um, boat building is one of the industries supported by recreational fishing, and that produces taxes, jobs, New motors and maintenance produces taxes. Fishing tackle produces taxes. Uh, bait production produces taxes. Okay, buying fuel. Uh, everybody in New Zealand who puts money into a, uh, uh, a boat is going to pay a road user charge for every liter of petrol they put into a boat. And that road user charge is not really um, reflected in what they're getting uh, for those taxes uh, because they are paying a higher amount per mile than people who are just driving cars. Uh, I've got this one in because there's a, a guy up the road from here that takes a fish and smokes it. This is a fish smoking and he um, cans that smoked fish and gives it back to the people who who bring the, the fish to them, who can't be bothered with, with um, trying to smoke a whole marlin. So, and then you've got other industries like this boat stacking industry. Lots and lots of other industries. And they all produce taxes and jobs for people and uh, contribute to the economy. So 
in the next video we will focus on which has more impact commercial or recreational fishing and since we're paying all these taxes to go recreational fishing shouldn't we expect a little something in return from the government in terms of a um, uh, consideration when a fisheries manager makes decisions